covid hair loss hair loss after having covid is becoming extremely common we are seeing 3 5 8 patients a day patient coming with lot of hair loss very anxious when i become bald this video is to give you information on this type of hair loss i am dr venkat ram mysore consultant dermatologist hair transplant surgeon venkat center for skin ent and plastic surgery vijayanagar manshankari kanak hamro bangalore what is covid hair loss why does it occur covid as you know is a type of viral infection and in this particular infection there is severe infection of the lungs and other systems of the body several cytokines are released these cytokines cause a lot of inflammation whenever there is inflammation in the body whenever there is any fever high degree fever whether it is covid chikungunya dengue malaria typhoid there is a period of hair loss why is this so because hair grows in three stages growing stage resting stage and falling stage when there is such high fever the growing phase is abruptly cut short all the hairs get into the resting phase and then they get into the falling phase and fall this type of hair loss is called telogen effluvium and is extremely common after all types of fevers in covid this is even more so because of three reasons one as you know covid is a severe infection and lot of different cytokines are released two patient receives several drugs steroids azithromycin ivermectin doxycycline uh, favaprin I mean, so many other drugs are received they all can cause hair loss and lastly and most importantly covid patient is under severe stress patient is isolated in a room locked can't talk to anybody can't see anybody and he is worried what will happen to him what will happen to his oxygen what will happen to his lungs he keeps on checking his oxygen levels with so much stress the stress itself induces hair loss so it is not at all surprising that there is severe hair loss after covid and this hair loss doesn't happen immediately it happens a month month and a half Two months later, and it can be profuse in somebody. Two hundred hairs, three hundred hairs falling per day. People come with bags full of hairs to show us. But this is not serious. I want to tell you this. This is hair loss may be severe, but the condition is not severe. It is temporary. The hair will recover with simple treatment and will come back to normal. By itself, it does not lead to baldness. So do not worry that you will go bald. now sometimes patients are sir telling us sir covid was negative i had a little fever cough but covid was negative some other people say i didn't have covid but i had vaccine can it also cause hair loss remember asymptomatic covid also releases cytokines cytokines and causes inflammation it is just that the body is able to fight it so it's quite possible that even mild covid which may have got unnoticed may lead to hair loss later after vaccine there is fever so these things are possible but the severity of such hair loss is very less now how do we treat this covid hair loss it is quite simple first of all we assure the patient that do not worry this will not be permanent you will not go bald you will recover then we give some vitamin tablets mineral tablets some lotions peptide lotions minoxidil lotion and we give a high protein diet hair needs proteins to grow most of our patients are vegetarians so vegetarian protein doesn't include vegetarian diet does not contain good quality proteins so protein supplements are needed those who eat eggs meat fish chicken they need to continue to use them we need 1 g per kg body weight protein so if somebody is 60 kg he need 60 g protein and during this period of covid hair loss he will need a little bit more so a good diet is very important avoidance of smoking relaxation avoidance of stress these are equally important then 
will I go buy it? By itself, COVID hair loss will not lead to baldness. But if you already have the baldness gene, if your hairs are already weak, if you are already having some thinning, those weak roots may not withstand the shock of COVID. So those hairs which are about to go in some time, one month, six months, nine months, they may go now. So in such patients, additional treatment may be needed. And after some time, we may have to give them platelet-rich plasma, a very good simple treatment, once in a month, four months, it's an extract prepared from your own blood. So that is one treatment which can be given. Now, last week I had a patient, sir, I had a severe COVID hair loss. I was very tense. I went to a clinic. They suggested you go for transplantation. Do I need a transplant? No. COVID hair loss does not need hair transplantation. Full stop. COVID hair loss patient should not undergo hair transplantation. Full stop. Please understand this. You are already having hair loss. A surgery will further increase it. It's a temporary hair loss. In any case, you will recover in two months time. So why waste money? Not just that. In an acute hair loss like this, if you do transplantation, you will actually end up losing more hair. So please do not fall prey to such commercial advices. Go to a qualified dermatologist and get it treated properly, simply at a minimal cost. At the most, you may need PRP if your hair roots are weak. But that is not for COVID hair loss. That is because for weak roots due to male pattern baldness. So be careful. Don't get stressed up. Take simple medicines. Consult a qualified dermatologist and you will get better. And proper diet, avoidance of smoking, avoidance of stress. These are all that are needed to manage COVID hair loss. So take care, be safe. This is Dr. Venkat signing off. I hope you have liked this video. I hope this information has been useful to you. If you need more such videos, please inform us, subscribe to our channel and visit our website venkatcentral.com. Thank you. Goodbye.